Hey everybody, welcome back for another edition of Beeble's Pantry. Today we're going to do something more serious. Uh, something I've been thinking about for a couple of months is uh, some safety items you may be aware of. And what, what prompted this is I've seen a lot of people driving around and they got the little pup with them and they're just driving right and this little cute, the dog's out the window and, and stuff like that. Uh, the problem is uh, when you're driving at 35, 55 miles an hour, highway speed 75 around the Phoenix area, um, Newton says an item in motion stays in motion until an opposing force comes and stops it. Well, that force is right here. When you see this SRS, that's a supplement restraint system, or the airbag, everybody calls it. There's one here, there's one in the, the passenger side, there's, they're all over the place. There's, there's a, a lot of them in most cars. But the most important is this one right here. When you're wearing a seatbelt, the seatbelt's going to stop you from going forward, and then you're safe. Problem is, you got your dog with you, right? So, all cute. We're going to take, we're going to take uh, Rufy with us here. Oh, Pickles, go for a ride. He said, "Here, well, the airbag is going to come out at least 10, 12 inches. And it's going to come out 100 to 100, uh, 100 to maybe 220 miles an hour in about uh, half a second." that quick you can't snap your face you can blink by the time it takes you to blink or sneeze this baby's coming out in about uh, uh about 55 milliseconds is what they say about half a second so it's important so just think about this if that airbag's going to come out to here okay and you got fluffy and i'm a tall guy i'm six too but if i'm sitting here if i'm a shorter person and this is typically what i see if I'm going to put my seat forward now because I'm short, let's say I'm 5'8", 5'10", the seat's going to be here, and your dog's sitting over here like this, and you're driving, and you're not, you don't see what's going to happen, and you impact something over about 25 miles an hour, that sensor on your front end is going to tell you the airbag's going to deploy, and your dog is going to go through your chest. You, he will be part of your heart and your lungs and everything else. You'll just crush your, you'll crush your sternum, your ribs, and you're dead. But you had your dogs with you, right? So that's important. But just take your dog, put him in a seatbelt on the side. There's there's lots of things you can buy restraints and, and and stuff for your pups in the back seat. Um, if you care about your dog, don't put them on your don't put them on your lap. Just don't do it. Let them sit in the back of the car with restraints on. You know, if you it's really cute, let them hang out the window and they neat and everything. But uh, if anything happens, you, know, you don't mean to. Uh, that animal is going to take every space you need, every bit of space you need to be safe from that airbag coming out. And they're, they're vicious. When they come out, it's explosive. And that's what I've got. So be safe out there. Drive safe. Be careful. Uh, stay hydrated, if you know what I mean. Uh, this is, if you like what you see, like, subscribe at the bottom down there. And this is uh, Bevo's Pantry signing off once again. Be safe. Peace.